Breaking news, my lovely, wonderful people. Something quite interesting happened in the last couple of hours. And um, we thought to tell you because um, it, sh it seemed, okay, that not just the ordinary man who is believing that we can have a fresh government and things can be different is expectant. Even the most, you know, even, even those in government are still very much anticipating what could possibly be the result of the election we are looking forward to. What's happening right now is that uh, Peter, they said, uh, you know, some senators were told, tell Peter Obi to give you ministerial slots. Don't disturb President Tinubu, a boy in senator, reveal how they were shunned. So and a boy, uh, some of the uh, boy in senators, you know, they are senators representing different senatorial uh, districts said, you know, they, they sent message that they should also be given ministerial slot. If you notice very closely, just five people from the Southeast were given ministerial uh, position. And he said, you know, the funniest thing, we, we want honestly and sincerely things to be done differently. He says, uh, you know, when they, when, they, when they spoke about this, they told them to wait for Peter Obi. You know, it, now it goes two ways. It could either be a mockery, or it could be a true statement that somebody somewhere, you know, have a heart or a mind, you know, saying that things will be different, that possibly there is possibility. So it could be from a place of mockery. It could also be from a place of assurance that something is going to happen. The hope of the common man will not be dashed. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Tell Peter Obi to give you ministerial slots. Don't disturb President Tinubu Eboin senators. Reveal how they were shunned. The senator representing Eboin North Senatorial District on the platform of the ruling of Progressive Congress APC, Senator Onye Kachiki Onye Kachuku, has said that when Southeast senators protested and demanded for more senatorial slots in President Bola Ahmed Tinubu's government, they were reminded that the Southeast re region voted for Peter Obi and Labour Party in the 2023 presidential election. Senator Nye Kachiku, who is the vice chairman of Senate Committee on uh, Preparation and, wa and Water Resource, said this while speaking at the news conference in Abakaleke, Ebonyi State, the capital, on Monday. Oye Kachuku, therefore, advised the people of the Southeast region to learn to play politics that will favor the region. We were told that we voted for Peter Obi, and so we should wait for his appointment because it will surely come. We were mocked. But you know the funniest thing? What you are calling a mockery might become a reality. We don't know. We're just saying. The news agency of Nigeria, NAN, quoted Oye Kachiku as saying, in the in the ministerial list, some geopolitical zone got nine slots, some got eight slots, others got seven, but the South is only got five. When the South is agitated for more slots, it, they were reminded that they voted for Labour and that they voted for Peter Obi, so they should wait for Peter Obi's appointment. Welcome to United Nigeria. Uh, if, in case you are still wondering. Welcome must become the order of the day. You must be thoroughly welcome. I must welcome you. So this was what they did to the gentlemen. They told them to go and wait. That Peter Obi is coming for them. Peter Obi will give them the appointment they desire. That have they forgotten? It was Obi they voted for, not Tinubu. And I wonder to myself, when Tinubu came in, he did not come in saying um, he was going to do this or that. There is a way to build about unity. Now, let's speak about now what is happening, whether you like it or not. Tinubu is Nigerian's president as at now. By the time the court decide, we'll now know who is the real president. But for today, now, is Tinubu. Now, Tinubu came in on the back of the Southeast agitating that they've been neglected from government because we must call a spade a spade. If you are not in the shoes, it is easy for your mouth to be ch -ch 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 -ch. But if you are there for a second, take a deep thought. Relax, chill, chill, take a chill pill and relax and think about it. That consistently and constantly, when something comes, you are being, you, you, you know, they unavoidably, they just, they just neglect you. They just, you know, it just slips past. 
Okay, me will take her. Me will, let's bring it home. You go party. Not me say you not get rice for house. So. Not me say you not cook her. We correct chicken and talk you. When you hot, when they steam like this. So we plant in to match and, uh, and salad. Oh. You get that food for house. No, and you know the funniest thing? You are open. You are not like the person that says, I go to party and I don't eat. So your mind is totally zeroed. You are open. You don't mind eating. Then they come to serve food. They serve to your neighbor by your side. They get to you. Then they pass. Then they get to the other neighbor and they give them food. That's one food has passed. Then they come again. They serve something else. They serve to the other. They give, give to everybody. Everyone around you. They serve to this neighbor. They get to you. Then they pass. They get to the other neighbor. They give the other neighbor and they pass. How would you feel? How would you feel? Let's be honest now. How would you feel? Will you not feel that you were not wanted in that place or there is something somebody is trying to tell you that you don't know about? Exactly. That, that's how you should feel when you think about the situation of the Southeast. So don't go all righteous on me saying, eh, eh, but they voted for Peter Obi. No. If you really want to form, because Tinubu came on the back that he wants to form a unity government, these are the people that you should also give opportunity. So much so that they will be the ones singing your praises. They will say, no, that man, ah, he was a different breed. When he came in, we felt a part of the government. In fact, people's words, you will not need to tell anybody that it is your turn. People's words will begin to speak for you. People will begin to fight for you naturally. They say, no, that man, don't talk about him like that. I can tell you. He's a people's man. He's a people's person. You know what he did for us? Don't please, please, please. I, I, took, I take an exception to that. I will not allow you in any way, form or kind to talk about that person like that. The people will be the one. The people by themselves will be the one fighting for you. Then you neglect them. They come to you and they said, ah, what's going on? We've been neglected. Then what, what was your response and your reply? Eh, you've never seen anything. Should be now be you vote for. Eh, go and wait for B. How would you feel? I just gave the illustration of you going to a party. And when you get there, when you get to the party, they keep avoiding you. Is as what would you feel? Won't you pack your bag and baggages and go home? Between me and you, let's be honest. Won't you pack your bag and your whatever and go home? That's how the South East feel. And I may not have painted the picture correctly, but I'm trying very hard to make you see that it is wrong to make somebody else feel that, you know, they are not, you know, they are not wanted. God bless. Have a good day. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye for now.